We've gone underwater with a video camera, but if you want to take some great still photos underwater, or you may be out in a more rugged sort of area where your camera gets banged around, you may want one of these. This is uh, the new Sea Life camera, and they claim that it is the most rugged camera out there. And uh, tell me a little bit about this. I mean, you want to say it's rugged? You've driven a car over your camera. Yep, that's exactly what we've done. Actually, this was on a whim one day. Our engineer and our R&D team were sitting around and we're going, we know it's tough. We've dropped it from six feet, but how tough is it? So we decided to take it out in the parking lot, take the Jeep of our engineer and drive over. And we went, wait a second, this is cool. This works. So we've done the same thing here to show how rugged it is. And uh, it'll withstand all the pressure from that. I mean, we've built the camera so it can withstand six feet, but this obviously shows a little bit more than a six foot drop. But it is totally waterproof, even running over it, so you can still use it, don't have to worry about it. So if you're out for a week doing different things, you don't have to worry about the camera getting banged up and not being able to be using it. And tell me just a little bit about the camera itself. Uh, you know, how, what kind of pictures does it take? Well, the camera itself is a six megapixel camera uh, that has video capabilities as well. It's a land camera, but it's depth rated to 75 feet. So if you happen to be a diver or a snorkeler, you can use it as well. But the 75 foot depth rating gives you true waterproofness. It doesn't have a time limit. It doesn't say, you know, go take down to 10 feet and then worry about right. it. Um, it also has a couple of really cool it's features. It's got one which is called right spy mode, which allows you to take pictures on a uh, time lapse. So you can set also it to take pictures every three seconds or 10 seconds. So you can put it out in the woods and see what comes around your campsite. That's uh, fantastic. Well, let's take a look at some of the photos that uh, you've taken uh, here sure. with these cameras. And uh, where, also, where do you pick one of these up? This is, uh, is not something I think that you get in your, your average Best Buy. No, no, not Best Buy. I mean, uh, what we're looking at here is actually, this is our first year at the Outdoor Retailer Show, so we're sort of expanding into the outdoor market. Uh, currently, we are being sold in Bass Pro Shops, Cabela's, and the dive community, so a lot of your dive stores will have it. Uh, if you go to our website, www.sealife-cameras.com, we've got a dealer locator so you can find out who's actually carrying it. And you've got, a, it looks like, a couple of different models. Yep, we've got three different models. Uh, we've got the DC600, which is our full dive version, good to 200 feet. Uh, that has a removable camera, but it also, most importantly, has some programming in it for diving. Diving's got some inherent problems. When you go down 200 feet, you lose a lot of light and a lot of color. Everything comes blue. So we've got some built-in programming that actually brings colors back. Now that's true for all the cameras. Next we have, unfortunately we've only got a beat up one here, but the ReefMaster Mini, which is good to 130 feet, accepts accessories as well for divers, but is also rugged enough for somebody that wants to use it in the outdoors. And then we have the EcoShot, which is the camera that we're premiering here, and that's good to 75 feet, six foot shock, uh, six foot shock proof, and it's got all the features as well. All right, fantastic. Thanks so much for uh, taking the time. Not a problem.